peace be with you welcome back to my channel for another video another spiritual download if this is the first time that you're coming across my channel i just want to greet you by saying hey there hi there and hello there you're more than welcome to like this video share it comment and or subscribe whatever you feel that your spirit has guided you here to do i pray i hope that you find the information that's going to bring you some type of clarification so you can make a determination, maybe about a situation that's long overdue for you to make a decision. Whatever you decide to do, please pick up what belongs to you and leave the rest for somebody else to take. Sounds like it's simple, but sometimes people struggle with that. Listen, come in with your higher self. I pray that you have a direct connection to source. That way you can determine what you are doing on your spiritual path and where you're going. Whatever you decide to do, I am here to support you in that energy. Be it good, bad, or indifferent, our meeting is not by coincidence. You have free will, and I hope that you choose wisely for the betterment of your higher self. Nevertheless, welcome to what I like to consider, what we like to consider, me and my soul tribe family, what we consider a spiritual court. If you're returning back to the channel, then you are my beautiful, wonderful, amazing, incredible, vibrant, intelligent, spiritually ascending soul tribe family. I love y'all so very much. I thank you for all of the love, support, the likes, the shares. Right now, personal readings are on hold. If I owe you a personal reading and you'd like to um, you know, talk to me about it, send me an email. But right now, those personal readings are on hold just for a moment. I am still holding those offerings and those payments as advised by spirit. But baby, let me just tell you, this big shift is going to require us to give attention to things that need to be uprooted. Okay. When I mean uprooted, I mean making final decisions on some of these lingering relationships and or habits that cannot go with you into 2024. Only you know in your spiritual closet what that is. Judgment is absolutely being served and nobody's exempt. Come on in here and get this spiritual work. I call upon the highest of white light. Only the highest of white lights. Anything other than that, then guess what? We just return it back to sender. Anybody that's sending us any ill will or any ill intentions, we do not give that energy permission to be here. Give me just a moment, y'all. One moment. Okay, so listen, this is a very crucial time. You know why? Because the stakes are higher than they've ever been in your entire life. We got life-changing situations, things that are going to change our life for the better. And so because of that, of course, you know, the enemy is trying to amp up whatever the, it is that they believe they got power in. You and I know that any enemy that has to ask permission from the universe to do anything absolutely cannot touch you and has no power let's go ahead and just dive right into the energy i've already called in my appropriate protection i pray that you have done the same i know that we are all wise enough to do that at least i hope so so let's go ahead and get into it and see what's going on spirit divine angels show me what it is that i need to see somebody's hoping that you stay confused these are new enemies, new enemies, new levels, new devils. I just heard you already have them defeated. These people are doing witchcraft on you out of fear. Somebody is saying they've never seen somebody like you. You're like an anomaly, okay? I don't know if you're new to a neighborhood, a town, a city, a school, a, a state, a job, but somebody is doing this out of being afraid. They don't want you to see their sins. Somebody's afraid that you're going to call judgment. Yeah, here we go. Illusions. 
Somebody's afraid that you're going to call judgment down on their sins. I just heard smoke and mirrors. Smoke and mirrors. Somebody is possibly doing some type of mirror work to try to confuse somebody from seeing something. Somebody feels like you have the authority. Yeah, here we go right here. Somebody feels like you have the authority to call judgment down on them. Somebody knows that you're an earth angel. You're illuminating a lot of light. And it absolutely it has their demons scattering. Like running all over the place. Somebody is actually doing smoke and mirrors. Somebody could be trying to um, open up some type of portal by way of mirror magic. Three of wands. These are people at a distance. I'm being guided to take the page of swords. Because I absolutely know that it's significant to this Two of Swords, Seven of Cups illusions. Page of Swords is somebody spying, monitoring spirits. Somebody could also be trying to open up a portal. Three of Wands. Somebody's at a distance. Okay, trying to do this. Show me what else I need to see, please, and thank you. Show me what else I need to see. Yeah, somebody wants to spy on you. They're afraid of you. They're doing this out of fear, terror. Yeah, Ace of Pentacles. Somebody feels like you're a gift from above. Somebody knows that you are an angel. Ace of Pentacles is a gift. Okay? Along with this comes righteous judgment, though. Something about righteous judgment. What are these people covering up? Who are these people? Queen of Cups and the reverse. This could be somebody's mother. Queen of Cups is somebody who um, is not loving, caring, and kind. Normally, I see that as a mother, okay? Show me what it is I need to see, please, and thank you. Yeah, the devil. Somebody's obsessed. Somebody could be calling on the devil, okay? To try to sacrifice somebody. Something about smoke and mirrors blinding you, illusions. Somebody does not want you to uproot some type of curse, you know, you ever heard of strongholds? Somebody doesn't want you to uproot some type of curse. Okay, the devil could be significant or the devil is significant. Capricorn energy. All right, five of pentacles. Somebody feels left out in the cold. A missed opportunity. Judgment. They're sneaky and deceptive. Somebody wants heartbreak and heartache in your life because they're going through karma. This is what they want. Show me what it is I need to see, please, and thank you. Yes, yeah, a tower. Somebody wants a tower for you, but show me this person. I feel like they're the ones that are getting a tower. Let me pull for my yellow cards. Divine, I dedicate these cards to you. Please show me what it is I need to see. Please continue to put my angels around me, and they have my permission to war with and or destroy anybody doing any mirror magic, any evil lie energies, Speaking negatively upon my name, using the Bible to curse me and my lineage, all of that evil magic, whatever that is, I give my angels permission to have dominion over it and dismantle it. Yeah, chase these evil ball heads out of the town is what I'm hearing. <laughs> chase these evil people out of the town. Listen, show me what I need to see. Show me these people, current energy. Yeah, four of swords. I keep getting four of swords. So somebody could be trying to wish some type of sickness on you or this person is sick. Okay, that's doing this. Show me this mirror magic, smoke and mirrors, smoke and mirrors, okay? Somebody wants some smoke in the city. Somebody wants conflict. Somebody wants sickness. Somebody, this is what they're wanting. Yeah, I can't make it up. Somebody wants to fight. Somebody's angry because you won't fight them in a silent competition but this is my thing what is this about can we just have a real commercial break it's a cowardly battle look at this illusions trying to blind you from the truth but spying on you at a distance that's a coward creating smoke and mirrors or creating this illusion but silently wanting to wage war on you but it's almost like somebody wants to blindfold you so that they can get their lick back this person has a lot of hate for you. This is a sacrifice. The hangman and the devil. And it's a tower. They're either wanting a tower for you, but now it's a tower for them. For a sword, spirit is sitting somebody's ass all the way down. 
Show me these people. Who are these people? Smoke and mirrors. Show me what it is I need to see. Somebody's trying to open up a portal. Somebody could be using some type of smoke or incense to open up a portal to try to see what it is that you're doing. Okay. Somebody could sage their mirrors. Yeah. Three of pentacles. Somebody's collaborating with somebody else to do it. Here's the hierophant. Show me these people current energy. Yeah. Eight of swords. Bound. Somebody's lost. These people are confused. Somebody could have astral projected, tried to open up some portal and got lost in the portal by way of trying to travel. I kid you not. I kid you. The, I kid you the heck not. Three of Pentacles. Somebody's collaborating again. It's giving me gang gang energy, cowardly energy because they're hiding. Somebody doesn't want you to see their sins. Somebody does not want you to see what it is that they're doing, but they're trying to open up some type of a portal. They could be using a mirror. This seven of cups is giving me illusion, reflection, water. Somebody could be using water and smoke. Okay. They want to create some type of an illusion, something to blind you so you can't see what it is that they're doing so they can spy on you. Okay. But somebody is keeping their distance. Even if they're close, they're at a distance by way of this cowardly energy. Okay, again, in this cowardly energy, the way they're doing this is they want you sick to slow you down. These are people collaborating. This could be a group of people. Okay, the number three could be significant by way of how many people are here. The tower is here. I feel like they're catching a tower. We'll clarify that. Eight of Swords is somebody going through some type of dark night of the soul. But this to me is travel, travel, distance. I'm getting like astral travel but getting stuck in between a realm by way of the ether somebody could have tried to astral project or come through a portal or try to see like they're trying to see what you're doing somebody wants to see you okay the hierophant is a spiritual practitioner somebody's being forced to walk away or they want you to walk away i feel like they're walking away show me these people current energy please and thank you smoke and water smoke and mirrors something like that portal Energy, King of Cups, okay? Scorpio, Pisces, and or Cancer and energy could be very, very significant. Hmm, somebody's in regret, Five of Cups. Something's a missed opportunity. Something didn't work out as they had anticipated. Yeah, somebody could have tried to cause some type of sickness. Show me these people, smoke and mirrors. This really reminds me of that story the other day with the King of Cups and the King of swords i think it was and a queen of swords or something like that and a king of wands but we'll see it's very similar show me what else i need to see please and thank you yes again two of swords it's clarifying the two of swords these people want to blind you from the truth of something but i feel like you already see so this queen of cups in the reverse is somebody wanting to block your intuition thank you spirit because i'm like queen of cups what yeah somebody wants to block your intuition queen of cups in the reverse is like for you not to see not to use your gifts okay is what i'm getting blinding you creating illusions some type of um paranoia here we go eight of swords somebody wants you in a paranoid state not knowing what's what confused somebody wants confusion yeah but it's been illuminated you could pray a lot whoever you are you can see just fine Something about the sun, something's been illuminated about a fake friendship. Whoever this uh, King of Cups is, this is not a real friendship. Knight of Cups, this is somebody that's flighty. They're being forced to walk away. Mm -hmm. Spirit says, what I'm saying is the truth. This person could be at a distance in another state. Okay, but whatever they're doing, they're really good or they used to be at what they were doing by way of astral projection. Show me their current energy. Why is that tower and the eight of swords here? Show me the current energy, please, and thank you. Justice. Balance is being restored. Something about the next three days I just heard for them. Yeah, okay. Yeah, balance is being restored. So they could now be suffering from some type of illusion. Seven of cups. Okay, when I see this justice, you could pray a lot. Like, what is this? Where is this coming from? This is what I'm getting. Somebody wanted to block your intuition so that you could not see and cause a tower in your life. Somebody wanted you to kind of be spazzing out and going crazy, kind of, you know, reverting back to some type of old cycle by way of shadows is what I'm getting. I feel like you're too evolved for that. Justice is here. Mayata's in the building. Seven of Cups is illusions. 
somebody's wanting to create illusions. This is what they're doing. Show me what else I need to see, please, and thank you. Archangel Michael. Yeah, Knight of Swords. Look at this. It's like somebody is a fake friend. Somebody's not a real friend. Somebody could have air and water in their chart. Mm -hmm. They want to fight. Yeah, Knight of Pentacles. This is a fake, phony-ass friend. But why? What's the point of all of this? I feel like they want your power. Archangel Michael, or just to cause some type of disruption. Okay, Four of Cups is a missed opportunity. Ten of Cups, this could be somebody in your family or somebody that you treated like family, right? Like we got our soul tribe family, something like that. Missed opportunity is Four of Cups. Knight of Pentacles, somebody is not a real friend. They're coming up as a knight. Even though that King of Cups, somebody could be appearing to be somebody caring, loving, and kind on the surface. Somebody's doing this just for shits and giggles. Just to prove that you're not gifted. Queen of Cups in the reverse. Show me who this person is. What's the point of all this, Archangel Michael? Yeah, the moon. It's like they want, yeah, they want your gifts. Somebody wants to play with your gifts. The moon. Ten of Pentacles. It's an illusion. Maybe to discourage you, to have you feel as though something is not going to come into fruition for you. Okay? Yeah, and your power. These people want your power. Show me the smoke in the mirrors, people, or whatever they're doing with the smoke. <laughs> the devil. Somebody's petitioning the devil. Yeah, worker. Here we go. Capricorn energy. Look. Somebody's working real hard. Could be a Capricorn. Could be a, um, a water sign. Could be a water sign and a Capricorn and possibly an air sign. They could be collaborating. Okay. Earth sign, air, and water. Three of Pentacles. Heavy on the Capricorn energy. Toil and labor. Somebody's working real, real hard too to try to make this be like a real manifestation. They could be calling on death. Somebody wants to end your Ten of Pentacles and your Ten of Cups. Show me what else I need to see, please, and thank you. So somebody wants to, yeah, okay. They want to stop destiny. They want to stop destiny. Something about you destined to be great. Something about you destined to be seen. Something could be landing you in the public eye. Somebody is playing with your, trying to play with your gifts. Trying to create some type of confusion. Show me what I need to see. Current energy, please and thank you. They're under judgment, though. They're kind of they're a little scared. <laughs> this was supposed to work. Yeah, judgment. Will of fortune. Something about what goes around comes around. Somebody's hoping that this does not come around. Five of swords. Yeah, they're fighting. Like they want you to fight for this. Somebody wants you to always be in fight mode paranoia eight of swords somebody wants you to feel like oh my god it's happening again oh i've been there when is it gonna stop like that type of an energy why am i feeling all this attack this is an illusion you know it though i feel that you're very very calm so funny i had this conversation with somebody earlier um about somebody that i felt was trying to project something onto me and i didn't know what it was and then i kind of got quiet and still after I got off the phone with her and it just was clear. Like I knew where it was coming from. Yeah, somebody's on under judgment. Righteous judgment is being called down. Five of swords. Yeah, somebody wants some conflict with you. Spirit says this is the truth. Somebody at a distance. There's three people at a distance. Whoever they are, they ain't got nothing else to do. This is all they, they do is this. Yeah, look, six of cups. People that you left out in the cold from the past too. Somebody is up the creek without a paddle. Somebody wants you to stay stuck in the past, okay? By way of like some delusional state of mind, like, oh, I'm getting like frustration, you know, seven of cups, illusions, uh, the moon, something's not as it appears, not listening to your intuition, okay? But somebody's walking the hell away. <laughs> Somebody, no, better yet, they're running away. Why is it Eight of Cups here, Archangel Michael, please? And thank you for these people, this Three of Pentacles, this uh, gruesome threesome. <laughs> Mini, my, Mo, and Jack, or whatever their names are. Yeah, look, the Three Stooges. 
They're walking away because something is not as it seems. They could be trying to befriend you. Be nice. This Knight of Cups, Knight of Pentacles, Knight of Swords. They're knights. They're not genuine. Even on this King of Cups energy, this could be you or this could be somebody on the surface appearing to be a certain way by way of an illusion with the Seven of Cups. The moon is here though. They know that you know that something's not right about them. They intuitively are feeling that you're figuring something out. This is so funny. Show me these people. Why is the Eight of Cups there and the moon? Please and thank you. Yeah, they're paranoid. Somebody's trying to protect themselves from what? Their own energy? Nine of Wands. Somebody's paranoid way down. And somebody knows that you're protected. Show me these people. Why are they walking away? Eight of Cups. Show me why the Eight of Cups and the moon is here. Please and thank you. Show me why that's here. Please and thank you. Yeah, this is crazy. Why do people do this to themselves? Like, you got to be crazy. Somebody's sick. Somebody's sick, y'all. From doing sickness spells, um, some type of paranoia. I was going to say paranorma. Paranoia? Is it paranoia or paranorma? What is it when you got the spirits running around? Paranor par paranormal? Why can't I think of this? what it is? You know, extra extra energy around, okay? Spiritual energy, yeah. It's crazy. Somebody's sick. These people are goofy. Somebody got sick trying to make you sick, toil and labor. They're still working and doing it. This is current energy. Somebody's in their head spazzing out because they know that you know. Somebody could be trying to come through some type of portal and can't. Or send something through a portal or open up a portal, okay, for something to come at you and they can't. Show me what I need to see. The lovers is here. Oh, God. It's always the lovers in the background. Let's just see why that's there. Somebody missed an opportunity with you. Show me why the lovers is here. Archangel Michael, please. And thank you. Why is that here? Why is it here? Why is it here? Why is it here? Woo-wee. Oh, God. There's my Virgo. I don't know what this is. Could be a Virgo. You could be a Virgo. Like, oh, my God. <laughs> what is it that we need to see? Please and thank you. The cherry is something about you finding the willpower to move forward. Yeah, somebody's heavy in regret. Somebody's heavy in regret. Somebody's trying to open up some type of portal on you. Toil and labor, they're working really hard too. What does this chosen one have coming in? I know the ace of pentacles and the ten of pentacles, but you're a gift. But this like they want to blind you. Oh, you're easing on down the yellow brick road. So you're the one in the Eight of Cups. You're walking away. You walked away from people that they missed an opportunity. Okay. Yeah, this is separation, heartbreak, severing ties, season of separation, Eight of Swords. Somebody tried to bind you, sneaky and deceptive. They're trying to stay with you or bind themselves to you energetically and they're under judgment. Somebody's really going through some type of financial hardship. They could have wished poverty on you. Okay, this is a missed opportunity. Queen of Wands, you're looking very attractive out here. Yeah, Knight of Cups is fake energy. Seven of, Seven of Wands is you trusting your ancestors. Like, what in the world is going on here? Show me the Smoke and Mirrors crew. <laughs> Trying to open up a portal. Show me these people with the smoke in the mirrors. Yeah, they're doing magic. Over a union. This is something about a union. Something about trying to stop you from balancing out energies. This is somebody in your family. This is somebody in your family. Okay. This is about you finding balance. Somebody's trying to do some type of magic over some type of soulmate union. They can instinctually feel that you're about to come into connection with somebody that's going to make you really happy. But this is family or somebody that you shared a family with. They're weighed down. Something was supposed to have been done by now. King of Wands might be significant. Okay, Ten of Wands, Eight of Wands, Sagittarius Energy, fighting, holding back. It's like, what is going on? Somebody wants to bind you and it's not working. Whatever you prayed about breaking this soul tie, you could have really just cried out to the creator like, I need to break this soul tie. Like, I need it broken sever whatever it is it's not coming together again for this person and so somebody is mad because they can't be bound to you show me what it is i need to see by way of the smoke and mirror somebody's trying to open up a portal this is somebody that goes through portals 
They could be trying to project some type of conflict energy onto you so that you're confused about who to choose. If you have another choice, okay, to be with somebody else, somebody wants you to be conflicted and confused. Seven of Cups, confusion, blinded to the truth. They're spying on you to see if you're going to choose somebody else. Nine of Swords, somebody's stressed out about you not being stressed out, but about you walking away and going towards something new. This is somebody that you had some type of household arrangement with, relationship, whatever this is. Five of Swords, show me what else I need to see. Whatever it is, it's been uprooted. The tie has been broken. Yeah, somebody's watching you on a public platform. I just heard it clearly, YouTube. You could be on YouTube. Show me what I need to see, please, and thank you. What's the outcome for this? Like, I don't even want to stay in this. You're taking a leap of faith, Spirit says, towards something new. Yep. Leaving the past behind. Mm-hmm. This in the upright, for me, is like flashing back nostalgia. This right here, somebody didn't want you to get over the past, but you're leaving the past behind. You don't even want to think about it. And the reverse for me is something like, okay, like, okay, that happened. Yeah, you're taking a leap of faith. Somebody did not want you to get over the past. They're working really, really hard. This eight of pentacles is like, damn, could be trying to cause death, take your power. Yeah, this hierophant. Somebody is really up the creek without a, 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 a I was going to say a battle and a paddle. Because I don't even think you're really giving this any attention. Not the type of attention that they thought they would be getting from you. And this is really pissing them off. Show me what else I need to see, please. And thank you. Yeah, they're really pissed off. They're really, really weighed down. Whoever this king of wands is, they could have petitioned somebody to help them do some type of work. But there's smoke and mirrors. They want you to be confused about a decision. They want you to be confused about life in general, your destiny, your path. But even in this two of swords energy, you can see through the blindfold. You're discerning by way of that ace of pentacles which way to go. Somebody wants you to be confused. Yeah, the hierophant. Somebody is really, really pissed off. Why is that hierophant here? Yeah, they know that somebody's coming in to make you some type of an offer. And this person wants you to accept their breadcrumb. Ooh, wee, don't do nothing with that breadcrumb. Leave that breadcrumb right there, please. Because I feel like whoever you are, you've been through things like this already. You're not in a position where you're making the same mistake. Somebody just wants to watch you and just see who are you talking to? What are you doing? What's going on? And it's a no, the universe is blocking them. Your ancestors are blocking them, yeah. Five of Pentacles, they feel abandoned by you, left out in the cold. They could also be going through some type of financial um, financial strapped situations. This is somebody very materialistic. You know, money, 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 money. This could be the reason that they're going through this karma. Nine of Swords and the Five of Pentacles. Yeah, they feel left out in the cold. Somebody could want you to come back because they need money. What is it? Are they want your abundance or power to manifest? Show me what I need to see. Yeah, King of Swords. Somebody is cold-blooded. Somebody is like, I will sacrifice who I need to sacrifice. Somebody is absolutely trying to open up a portal to send deities into your house. Okay? This is what the smoke is for. Judgment is here. They're under judgment. They're sneaky and deceptive. They think that they're going unsuspected. But your ancestors are all over it. Your angels are fighting night and day, trying to bind you to them, trap you, scare you. Somebody wants you to be in fear. Somebody's watching you be independent and they're waiting for news. They want they want somebody to report back to them. Okay, this could be deities, spirits, whatever this is. They're, they open portals. Yeah, this is slow moving energy. Somebody's trying to play some type of mind game and they're in this weird energy thinking that you're waiting for them. And I don't feel as though you are. <laughs> I just, I don't know. Call it a hunch. Yeah, show me the sm smoke and mirrors guy. Yeah, here they go right here. Sneaky and deceptive. But your spirit team is all over it. Look, ultimate betrayal. Somebody's trying to sacrifice you. Show me this person with their stupid ass. Because this is so stupid. Yeah, look, the empress. Libra and energy. 
Why is that here? Because you got a new beginning. That's why. You could be, yeah, three of cups. Somebody, somebody's working together with somebody else in threes, okay? Show me what I need to see. Why is it three of cups here? Yeah, somebody's under judgment. Somebody's watching you celebrate. So this is you. When I asked about this person, this is how they see you. They're just watching. They're jealous, giving you the evil eye. You are the empress. You call righteous judgment down on this situation. They're sneaky and deceptive because they don't want your ancestors to know that it's them. That's opening up a portal to send some type of deities to you. And so they're trying to do it in a very sneaky and deceptive way. But you already know what it is. So somebody's trying to block your intuition. Also could be some people in your family as well. These could be family members too. People that you're still praying for, it looks like. Wow. What's the outcome in the situation for these people? Let's pull from these cards. What's the outcome for these people in this situation, spirit? Heavy regret. I can't make it up. And look, even at the bottom of my other deck, the seven of wands is the ancestors are protecting you, covering you, watching you, proud of you, celebrating you. Five of cups is going to be regret disappointment they're working honestly for nothing somebody's up doing a lot of spiritual work for nothing for nothing trying to send deities to you to wreak havoc just just kind of upset your energy really they can't really can't do anything i think the spirits are even confused somebody tried to astro project and it's, it's like nah it's a wrap it's nothing but disappointment, sadness for these people. Conflict. They could be fighting. These people could be fighting. Spirit says, what I'm saying is the truth. Yeah, they're at a distance. I don't even think you, you're near these people. Show me what else I need to see, please and thank you. What's the outcome? Final outcome, please and thank you. Lord, have mercy. You're still the empress. This is what Spirit is saying. Like You're still going to get whatever this is that you're going to get. Whatever this is that they're trying to stop you from, you're still moving towards what it is. Willpower. Somebody could have wanted to affect your energy. Um, yeah, somebody is upset because you're finding the willpower to move forward. Mm -hmm. And that you heal. They could have wished you some type of sickness, death illness some type of illness and they're upset because you've healed so somebody's sad because you you're you've healed and you left and you move forward <laughs> like oh and you took a leap of faith oh wow and you got new love and somebody's upset about that queen of pentacles somebody could want to marry you somebody's coming in to make some type of proposal you got a new beginning here after you went through a transformation. This is the message, though. Whew. These people need to get a life, honey, because 2024 does not have them in it. Moving forward, what I see by way of projection is these people don't exist on any timelines, realm, and or dimensions in our lives. They just don't. These portals that they think they're opening up, whoever situation this is, baby, somebody's getting stuck in the ethers, honey. Trying to open up a fourth. Oh, oh God. Woo. Confused. Trying to find their way back and can't. Somebody's spiritual GPS is off and they're getting frustrated. Because I think the more you purify your energy, the more you, you know, walk in faith, they really become afraid. Somebody is really trying to like, I see somebody itching up like this, trying to tie themselves to you. Like, this is how slow they're doing their magic and speaking their incantations, you know, and then you burp and then you realize the feeling goes away. <laughs> Smoking mirrors, honey. They're trying it. Somebody's really trying to see what you got going on. Whatever it is, they feel as though you're worth seeing something. Okay. It's how they feel. But this is the message. I love y'all. I'm just, I love y'all so much. All my information is down below. Personal readings are on hold until further notice. I got to clear out these other ones. And y'all, I had some issues with um, my email. So just please bear with me. Thank you so much for your patience. You know, we're so close to so many great things that 
there's been these little speed bumps in 2024 so far, but they're non-existent, y'all. It's just little bumps. We're like, look, you know what we've been through to this point, what we had to go through to get to this point. So these little tests are really nothing. They're just an illusion. Don't fall for it. Stay in your high vibration. Continue to be about your father's work. I love y'all so very much. I will see you in the next video, okay? Peace be with you.